Well, hello there. Um, we're finally around on this last episode, but we saved the best for last. We are talking about Malaysian Dream Girl Online, the first reality model search program that has got all the guys and all the girls out there logging in and they've voted week after week. And today we are doing the last photo shoot, rounding up to the finals. Next Tuesday, we'll watch all of you in Wanutama, right at the concourse, at the centre court where the biggest fashion stage is going to be built. And all you're going to come here and watch them in person. You'll see all these three girls strutting down the catwalk and make their money worth for voting for them. So who'll be the first girl to walk away as Malaysian Dream Girl? And we're going to try and bring the girls to another level and see what they have got to, to bring to the table. So you viewers and you voters, Vote for them and you be the judges, okay? And now we're down to the last three girls. So who are they? Well, congratulations, girls. These are top three finalists. We have Cindy, Adeline, and Hannes. So I'm sure they're ecstatic, right? So sit back, relax, enjoy the show. We're gonna create a little bit more of a silhouette. It was a high-end fashion photo shoot and I must say that's the most awesome great photo shoot I ever had. We got a dress here, packed with nice leggings and shoes from Nose. The dress is wrong. Tango, if I'm not mistaken. Hair to the sea of one of the top hair stylists. Hey, it's down, one, two, three, so this is what goes behind a photo shoot. Nice, but don't lose the neck. Then you push down. If you want to push your upper body forward, you push up your head. And there you go. Good. Nice. Try that again. I think it's better when we calm you down. You know what you're doing. You know, so do the hair, it makes the, the wonderful dress look greater. And it's so motivating. He's, just, he's a motivator, I would say. You're looking great. You know what you're doing. The fingers on the kids. I think Jimmy really did a great job in. Um, Bringing up the best in me. See, it's nice. You see, when you push your collar up, you see how nice it looks? I like it because it looks different. But with Jimmy, when he was there, it's just only working with him. So basically, she knows what she's doing. So now I think you can shoot a little bit crop until here, it'll be quite nice. I feel so good after the photo shoot. And it's the first time I feel so good. It's like, actually, I can do it. You know, I can do it. Why are you guys beating me down? You know, it's like, I, I look at the pictures and this is the first time I feel like, oh, I have a few choices, you know, before this it's like I only have one or two. And I was like, oh my god, there's so many pictures, I want all of them like that. Jimmy taught me how to smile with my eye. Before this, I was trying, like, I was trying, but it's, yeah, I learned two things. The first thing I did, I, I was always like this. Like my eyes are always like too big, like, to focus. Or it's either like, because when they say, you know, like, um, it's too tense, you know, like, close it a bit. So I was like, like that, you know, so my pictures are like kind of screwed up lah. But he was, he was, he taught me the right way. You know, how big, how big is the gap that your mouth should like drop. Or how much your eyes, how intense must your eyes be. So detailed that I can actually, you know, catch everything and learn. He, he showed it to me, how you do it. And I was like, oh, I got it. Like, I, yeah, I learned something. I learned a lot of things. Don't make me repeat myself. Chin up slightly. Wake up your eyes. Excellent, nice shot. Yes, one more. Now, now you're going this way. Go this way. Yeah, that's nice. The posing is not so elaborated. Every movement like matters lah, so you have to watch out for all your body language. Don't rub your eyes. There you go, beautiful. Nice! Good you have to have chemistry with the photographer. You have to listen to other people's advice and ideas and give and take. He's friendly. It's nice. Um, it's very, of course, it's very professional. Like, I've been doing it for like, 20 years. Oh, and go back to party. Take a deep breath. When you're ready, okay. get yourself composed. One, two, three. Nice, that's nice. The attitude is great. Very nice. Keep it like that. Beautiful. Yeah, very nice. Jimmy said it was nice. And like uh, we were scrolling down through all my pictures and uh, we were choosing la, which uh, the favourite and then we can choose the best shot. La, and then he was like, oh my god, this is nice. Oh my god, this is nice. Oh my god. So it's like so many favourites. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, Jimmy, uh, is a, like a host to teach us how to um, do this to that and then they help us to find the right angle and then they will like guide you all uh, how to post everything. He actually is very professional and then she not only the way that she, uh, he will show to us like this angle will look better and then she make more concern about everything and then it's like makeup, the hair, then every every simple thing that she would really really concern about that. They just like make it everything really good, make it perfect. I would say it's more easier and then but then it's very good also and then we got the very nice picture and then we know which one is our angle. Mm -hmm, then when we just uh, went up there and then we just posed there and then she just, uh, he would guide us like um, which you have to move up a bit, something like that. Uh, he would like um, more interact with us. If you have seen the past half an hour, we've edited the photo shoot, the final photo shoot of Malaysian Dream Girl, the very first reality program searching for our quintessential girl next door who will be groomed to be the next big thing in the modeling circuit. And judging from their performance, I think all three of them learned something new today after several weeks of being photographed and groomed and put into catwalk classes and exercise routine and being eliminated one after the other. But they're all gonna be at the finale, all back for a reunion for a very special show at Wanutama at the concourse in a brilliant stage. But only three girls will be being voted by all of you. Would it be Hannes, the beautiful 18-year-old Malay girl? Or would it be Cindy, the girl next door? Or would it be Adeline, the tall Chinese girl? It's all up to you guys. So remember, vote for them. And we will see you next week. Thank you.